Most important. And you said in 12 years, you were promoted five times. Yes. What kind of work ethic did that take? So honestly, it's it's not like I have like some magical power um, that that made me stand out above other people. I will say it's very basic things. One of it is a lot of people only do the duties in their job description and nothing mm-hmm. outside of that. They they look at the money that they're making and they feel like, okay, I'm only good enough to make $15 an hour. So I'm going to put in $15 an hour minimum work ethic. Yes. Oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Something that annoys me. I I was never that way. I always dressed for the job that I wanted, not the job that I had. And I worked that way. So I always had a mentor or buddy. And I would say, show me everything you do. Mm -hmm. So when I was in a leasing position, I would go to my manager, even my assistant. And I would say, like, let me shadow what you're doing. I want to learn everything that you do because I want to, if you're not here and you're sick, I want to be able to fill in for you. So I think just taking that next step and having initiative was number one. Um, also, you, I feel like in today's day and age, like you can't get people to show up on time for work. You can't get them to show up and look professional. So like literally just doing the basics yes. makes you stand out. Like the very basics. So I, I think just always pursuing more knowledge. Like I craved learning more. And I think that is a key element and having like grit. Um, Cause you, you can't get promoted if you're constantly just like, showing up for work and doing your actual job. You have to yeah. do your job amazingly well and learn the job ahead of you. Exactly. So I think that was a key deci- a key differentiator for me.